In the first step of the procedure, a surgeon uses computer software to identify the target tissue and create a surgical plan to precisely treat the target while avoiding healthy surrounding tissue. Next, the guiding piece of the frame is attached. After parting the hair, a 3.2 millimeter entry is made in the skull, about the size of a coffee stirrer. An MRI-compatible bone anchor is then fixed to the entry, which will allow for the introduction and securing of the laser applicator. The guiding piece of the frame is then removed. The laser applicator, which has a width of 1.65 millimeters, about the size of the lead in a pencil, is then inserted into the target lesion. The patient is then placed in the MRI and imaged in preparation for the precise destruction of the target. The laser fiber is connected to the laser energy source. The physician reviews the new images to verify proper positioning of the laser applicator within the target. A low power test pulse is delivered as a second confirmation of precise laser applicator placement. When the laser power is increased, Light energy is absorbed by the target tissue, heating it and destroying it. Depending on the size of the target, more than one laser position and activation may be used. During the time the laser is activated, special MRI images are converted to thermal maps and damage zone estimates in real time, providing precise feedback. Immediately following laser therapy, additional MRI images are reviewed to verify that the treated area precisely matches the surgical goal. The laser applicator is then removed and the scalp is closed with one stitch.